Hey guys, uh, in the part 1 of our video, we have learned how to solve a problem that involves ml per hour with a doctor's order of mics per kilogram per minute and with a stock on hand with a milligram per cc or ml by using dimensional analysis. Now, um, we're going to uh, have another solution for this and this solution uh, for me, it's kind of easier and uh, less analysis, okay? All you have to do is uh, follow my uh, modified equation, okay? So, um, this is what we're going to do. Uh, here we go. Order infused dopamine at 8 mics per kilogram per minute. On hand is dopamine mix, 800 milligrams per 500 mLs or cc's of D5 water. Patient's weight is 198 pounds. Calculate how many cc's per hour it is. So remember, we're looking for mLs per hour or cc's per hour. So we want to put 500 cc's or 500 ml on top. Okay, so 500. So 500 ml. That would be on top or 500 cc's. Okay, so then we're going to draw a vertical line like this. Okay, and then... Uh, we want to draw a line we want to draw a line this presents that we're working uh, our numerator okay which uh, some of this uh, half of this would be your doctor's order and so this would be your doctor's order and this one would be your stock on hand okay so um, uh, your order is to infuse 8 mics per what? Per kilogram. And then what, what's the other one? Per minute. Okay. And then what is your given problem? Um, what is your stock on hand? It's 800 milligrams. Okay. So 800 milligrams. We will put it as our denominator. Okay. And then we will compute everything here. So the reason why I say modified is because uh, my modified equation because we put ML on top. It's supposed to be here. But we could also do that. But in this equation, this is easier to get ML per hour. Okay, so uh, then we, we want to draw a vertical line again separating everything. Okay, all of this variable to another, another equation. Okay. So uh, we'll just continue doing this, okay? So one kilogram is how many pounds? Equals 2.2 pounds, right? So 2.2 pounds, and what's your given, what's the patient weight? It is 198 pounds. So 100, we put 198 pounds here, okay? And then, um, so we're working on this and then we have to work on this. Uh, for the minute so one hour one hour is equivalent to how many minutes 60 minutes so which one are we going to convert it's easier to convert and take out a uh, milligram to micrograms by going here so one milligram on your uh, on your denominator taking out that milligram okay one milligram is equivalent to 1,000 microgram okay so by the way uh, 198 um, divided by 2.2 what is your answer then so uh, you have 90 uh, 90 so that's your answer 90 okay then we have to uh, close this again okay by drawing a vertical line in um, now you want to cancel all of your uh, variables okay uh, you want to cancel uh, your units like this one um, micrograms cancel micrograms to your against your denominator cancel kilogram against kilogram pounds and pounds this one we can cancel this because we already have an answer that is 90 and then cancel minute against minute okay we cannot cancel hour okay milligram we cancel milligram against milligram <clears throat> And then uh, after canceling everything, don't forget to cancel your zeros so that you would not end up computing, uh, pressing a lot of zeros in your calculator that would make you vulnerable of mistakes. So just cancel 
of the two zeros from 500 to the two zeros from 800 and then cancel uh, the zero on 90 against the zero of 1000 and then cancel the zero of 60 against the zero of minutes 60 minutes so you have 8 times 10 is how much it is what it's 80 okay and then um, you would multiply 5 times 8 5 uh, 5 times 8 times 9 times 6 so 5 times 8 times 9 times 6 and it would be that would give you 2160 again you want to cancel again this zero zero from 80 and against the numerator 2160 so this will become 216 divided by 8 and your answer will be 27 27 and remember you have mls there okay and an hour there so 27 ml per hour so which one is easier you doing the dimensional analysis or this modified equation that I made.